Hey everyone, we're going to try to find the width of a gorge. For those of y'all in the city, that live in the city, the gorge is a narrow valley, uh, usually associated with hills and mountains, and usually there's a stream. And I tried to draw this picture with not very good luck um, of what was in the textbook here. But, you know, just act like this is a narrow valley. And what we're really, really looking at is this triangle right here. We want to find this width from A to C. So this is C. We want to find the length there. All right. We know that um, we're given that uh, during, according to the picture, that this is 35 degrees, this angle here. And the length from B to uh, C to B, or B to C, is 100, and, 100 feet. So, basically, we want to find this side right here. So, we, I'll just put that as X. So, what we have is opposite is what we're looking for. And the information we have is adjacent. So, opposite over adjacent is the tan function. So, that's what I'm going to use. So, um, I'm going to write tan of 35 degrees equals the length of AC, or you can call it X, over 100, 100 feet. Okay, and then you're just going to cross um, the 100 up here. So it's going to be 100 tan of 35 degrees equals your length of AC. Okay, and when you calculate that, make sure your calculator's in degrees, you get approximately 70.02 uh, feet. So that's what your X is, 70.02 feet. Okay? That's all. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.